Morning everyone. It's going to be another beautiful day for working. As you can see, I'm wearing a sweatshirt because it's a little chilly this morning. Yeah. So today we're going to be uh, doing a whole bunch of lawns today. we got a couple of shrubs to uh, trim up and uh, it's going to be a pretty productive day. So let's get the trailer loaded up and let's get started. Well, since we're uh, mowing crappy yards all day, and the last yard I was supposed to get a video at, I didn't get a video at, because I forgot. And uh, this yard here, the reason why I say it's crappy is because they all have dogs. And you know what, we're picking up in the tires and on our feet. So this yard, there's not much of uh, grass growing, there's a lot of weeds growing and crap everywhere. So Vicky's gonna mow the front with the 48 inch skag and I'll do the back with the Toro Time Master because they can't get the skag through the gate. So I'll get with you, uh, or actually we will get you with you after this yard. Alone. And 
Now you can see the world But you're blinded by the light Leading you from reason And straight into the night Now don't believe him He's a liar and a sugar coder Just wait until break of dawn But don't forget to leave the motor on He'll turn around But you will be gone You're drinking dirty water From the dirty well don't believe the glitter He's got plenty of things to sell Now one thing to remember And you will be alright uh, They promise you the world But they leave you in the night Now don't believe him He's a liar and a sugar coder Just wait until break of dawn But don't forget to leave the motor on He'll turn around But you will be gone Guess what's on her shoes? Okay, that crappy yard's all done. We're going to check out uh, one more yard. I don't think it's going to need to be cut, but we got to check it anyhow. So I think it was all pretty burned up last week, and all we did is uh, take care of some weeds there. It's a commercial account, but there's no grass. It's all yellow. So we're going to check that one out. There's uh, three other ones we have to check out, which I don't think we're going to be cutting uh, three of them neither. Just because uh, they're still yellow. And it's really dry. Uh, we got that two inches of rain the other day, and it, it helped a little bit, but it's not enough. We need lots more rain. Yeah. Because that last yard, uh, you know, dust was flying. So off to this next yard here. Okay, we ended up cutting that property. Also, there's just weeds and it looked horrible, so we just whacked the weeds all down, or mowed all the weeds down, I guess, and blew off the sidewalks. In and out in about 10 minutes, so off to the next yard. Must have had another dog. This freaking piles landmines all over the yard. Big ones. I tried to make a video. Again. Goodness, here we go. So, this yard that we haven't. When was the last time we were here? Uh, June something. Way back in June. So, it's been about a month, at least a month. It's been, yeah, we haven't cut it. One, two, three. This is the fourth week that we So, have it's a month. And it. all we did was just whack some uh, weeds down just because they were a couple feet high and were on the car, and that was it. And, yeah. There's dog crap everywhere on this one too. So, off to uh, the next yard, 
with animals. Two blocks away, there's two yards right next to each other that I push mow. And they're full of dogs. And they're full of dogs. So, uh, yeah, we kind of got them all on one week. June 20th was June the 20th. last time. So that's two weeks, or a month. Five ago. weeks. Five weeks, okay. Five weeks. Oh boy. Anyhow, and last year, we didn't skip that yard about maybe once. So, uh, let's check out these next yards, I guess. That's what we have, yellow yards. There's a few weeds, but there's no sense of cutting weeds. Burnt right up. It's Try to know that it's on. June 27th was the last time that these two lawns were mowed. And what's the date today? Today is the 18th of July. So, and we will not be cutting them yards for at least another two to three more weeks if we get enough rain. So we're going to go check out another yard that we have not cut in uh, four weeks. We and we have to trim the shrubs there, but we are uh, going to be holding off on the shrub trimming a little bit. Because it's too dry. Because it's so dry. And uh, we like mowing it after, we like mowing the yard after it's been... Uh, trimmed and pick all She's the clippings up but um this yard's a lot of nothing okay skipping over this yard too yeah it's all yellow and it's worse than the last one so we're gonna go check out one more yes that's how close these are i mean i'm pretty certain that most people in the area have not seen this much drought in many years That's an all right there also. So, on to the next yard. And that's the next yard. That one's been three weeks. There's a few weeds back there. This yard is starting to green up. We should be able to cut it next week. And the yard across the street. It's got straggly weeds on both of them. That's it. But we need to get the lawn to green up. That one there will be next week. So Vicki just said we were cutting grass for two hours. We had 16 lawns to do. It's 11 o'clock and we're done for the day. We would have one more to do, but we have to wait till after five because it's a commercial property. Actually, we probably could just do no, it. I'm not There's gonna nobody do that. there. It's flying in dust, but it's... Uh, we don't have to cut that one on any certain day. We just have to do that when it's closed. So um, last I looked at, the only thing is there, there's not grass there. There never is grass there, it's just weeds. So I will probably cut that first thing in the morning or later in the afternoon, I'm not sure. But uh, that one will get cut this week sometime. So uh, I guess we're gonna go drop everything off and go home. Enjoy your afternoon and, and we'll see you at the next yard. Still going on. Anyhow, that is going to be the end of our video for today. It's not what I wanted. Uh, everything's just not working the way we want. Every, nothing seems to be going right. Hence the name of Mark Smith's Fit World because nothing ever goes right. So that's going to be the end of our video for today, which I think I said already. Um, Thank you for watching and subscribing. If you could check out the links in the description box below, it would be greatly appreciated. Those links help support our channel. And always remember, have fun, make money, and make a difference in someone's life. And, and have a great afternoon, and we will see you at the next yard. Goodbye.